Let's look at some best practices to make your admin account much more secure. Coming up. Creating an administrator account on your 48 is a lot of responsibility that you need to take care of. Now, there are several steps that you can make your admin account much more secure. So let's just uh, do that and uh, we will start with system administrator. So that is your admin account. The very first thing, don't use a local user. Don't save your uh, or don't set your admin account locally on the 48 user remote authentication server. It is much more secure. So use LDAP or any other uh, remote authentication server. The second thing, which is quite obvious, use a two-factor authentication. Now you can use 40 token, you can use uh, 40 token cloud. You can also use your email as a second factor so that whenever you generate a one-time password, it will be sent to your email account. Uh, I have a video that I've done on that um, about a year ago. I will try to um, make it available on the description. The third thing is to restrict the login to a trusted host. So only uh, administrator that will come from that specific IP address that you can configure here or you can also use the command line with the config system admin. Let's edit the admin profile. Let's use the get to see the different options. You have about 10 trusted hosts that you can use to set the IP address to get uh, to the admin account from those IP addresses. Here you can also play around with the remote authentication server. You can set the password. You can play also with the SSH if you prepare, prefer to uh, do that using SSH. So you can play with the public uh, keys of your SSH connection. And what else? Let's just move back to the graphical user interface. Another thing is to settings, change the port number. Don't just use 443. Use another and an uncommon port such as 9811 so that anytime that you get into your um, 48 using its IP address, you will also use the port number make it hard to get to your account. All right, um, let's just now move to config system global. And here you can also play with different administrator settings, such as the number of administrators that can connect to your system. The default is, uh, I believe, 100 from 1 to 100, but you can set it to five you can uh, uh, set the um, number of sessions you can also play around with the lockout duration so whenever an administrator actually uh, is wrong with the password for three or five times it is being locked so it is being locked for how long for 30 minutes for one hour you can play around with those settings just look around, look at the documentary. You can set the admin maintainer so you can actually, uh, in case that you have lost the password, you can use the admin maintainer account to recover it. So don't treat your admin account as something that is quite obvious with the, uh, the IP address and the idle timeout and so on. Use it carefully and be sure to make it very secure so no one can actually get and uh, control your 48 firewall. 